vegetables. <laughs> Hello and welcome to a new weekly vlog. Um, unlike last week, I am starting this on a Monday, so it is going to be an actual weekly vlog. Hallelujah. Um, I filmed a little bit earlier this morning when I was in the gym. I was at the cafe bit and I was worked from the gym today. So I was really happy. I was there from, I started, started work at 6.30 because that's the time I got to the gym and I was worried that the technology wouldn't work or there would be no seats so I started work at 6 30 this morning and I finished at 4 so I, I've had a, a fairly long day and when I did waitressing and stuff I would have much longer days than that but um for this job that was a long day um so yeah uh, otherwise I have just finished dinner I just showed you dinner didn't I I showed you what we had um with lots of vegetables because they always say that, they always say, they say, uh, they, who are they? <laughs> what am I trying to say? Um, apparently you're meant to have half a plate or bowl of vegetables and then like basically like a quarter to your protein and a quarter to your carbohydrates, I believe. I'm not 100% sure on that, don't quote me on that. Um, so that's what I tried to emulate today with dinner. Lots of veggies, which was good, but I'm still hungry and I only have, how many calories do I have left? I have 90 calories if I'm tracking according to my fitness pal. Um, I actually did three different measure, measuring like techniques for how I need to, like how many calories I should be eating if I'm trying to lose weight. I did the NHS one, I did a different one, and then I did my fitness pal. And my fitness pal actually had the lowest calories. Um, but it's what I've been following. And it's working because the first week I lost four pounds, which was amazing, incredible. The second week I lost two pounds, and then I weighed in today and I lost another two pounds. So I've lost eight pounds in the space of three weeks, which I think is really good. Um, so yeah, I'm trying to stick to it as much as I can. Um, I've got 90 calories left, which I think is the same amount of, as one of my rice cakes that is over there. I don't really want to eat a rice cake, but... I want something else to eat, so I might have that. Anyway, um, I feel better. Thank you for all the well wishes on my um, other vlog from last week. Um, yeah, I, I was. it was a very weird, when I was editing, I was like, this is really weird when I was in the kitchen cooking. Um, I was just singing to myself and dancing and just, yeah, I think I, was slightly high on cold medicine but it was fine <laughs> um, so yeah i am finished for the work for the day finished eating for the day but yeah according to my carefully curated that's my photos i'm on the calendar app curated um calendar i'm meant to be writing for an hour um I'm tired because of my longer day, so I don't know if I'm gonna do that, but I want to, but I do want to, so we'll see. Um, oh, that's, that's, talking of the calendar, that's just reminded me, I had the biggest heart attack this afternoon. Something popped up on my phone saying someone wanted to add something to my calendar, and I looked, and it was like this spam thing, and they wanted me to click on someone's pictures, and they were like, click on the link to see my pictures. But it came up in like my actual calendar app and then like they sent like a spam email as well and i had to call apple support because it wouldn't delete off my phone but apple support were actually really good so like thank you apple um for helping me but like yeah it really scared me because i'm really careful with like spam emails and links and stuff and i never you know i, I feel like i'm quite fairly savvy with like the uh with the spammers these days but um yeah it really scared me because I didn't click on anything and it still popped up in my calendar and it wouldn't leave so yeah that was fun um and then they couldn't fix it at first because it wasn't apparently how they usually do it and I was like oh great of course I've got a new type of spammer <laughs> um but yeah that's my day uh, not much more to report so I'm gonna go 
um might do some writing might just watch youtube not sure <laughs> hello i'm at my desk um i think what i'm gonna do tonight is just read through my project so far i've written three chapters um not tonight i mean like already i've written three chapters um i think i'm gonna read that and like my kind of like synopsis and kind of just reacquaint myself with what I've done so far and what's coming uh because otherwise it's just going to be me writing blindly and that's not going to be very productive so I think that's what I'm going to do today and then tomorrow morning I'm getting up early to write she says let me check my calendar yes I've got my alarm set for six something so I can start writing and then go to work behind me <laughs> so that's the plan um but something exciting just happened my main channel has just hit 400 subscribers like literally in like the last hour and I want to cry and I told my mum and she was like and it's only January and I was like yeah I have been doing this 17 years <laughs> and it's taken <laughs> as in like I started my first channel 17 years ago so it has taken a while to get to this point but I'm feeling very grateful and I know what mum means she means it's only January of this year so I think where I might be by the end of the year kind of thinking I do I do understand but yeah um <laughs> it has taken 17 years to get technically to 400 subscribers because this is the these are the channels that I've had the most subscribers on ever even though I've been on YouTube for that long um so yeah I'm just feeling very grateful so I need I need to do some work now I need to do some writing work um I might put my headphones on and play some instrumental music um and then I think I'm gonna just watch some other YouTube videos on writing and stuff like that so it's like kind of relaxing kind of productive but yeah, thank you if you've subscribed, subscribe, I can't even speak. If you've subscribed, thank you very much. Um, that means a lot um, to me. just reading what I've done so far and I couldn't help but make like little changes because I first wrote this during NaNoWriMo last year and like I've got spellings wrong and stuff where I didn't go back to check it so I was just doing tiny edits as I was reading it um it's always weird when you read something back that you've not looked at for a while because you're kind of like did I write this <laughs> <laughs> like genuinely did I write this but yeah um I don't remember some of it so it's, it, it was good to read it back um I'm only halfway through chapter three I've realized it ends kind of halfway so I need to finish that that's probably tomorrow's job in the morning um but yeah I'm happy with what I've read um yeah so I'm going to, what am I going to do? Oh, I was going to read the um, book one outline, wasn't I? Yeah, I will read the outline and then I will watch some YouTube videos. Good morning. I'm talking quietly because it's 10 to 7 in the morning. 
and I've already been up and I've done writing and I've answered comments on YouTube and I've done all of those kind of bits. I, I wrote 300 words and that finished the chapter so I was like okay I'm gonna leave it and then tomorrow oh no not tomorrow I'm traveling to London tomorrow I've got work and a presentation that I'm really scared about tomorrow so we won't do it tomorrow but Thursday I will first start chapter four I thought that would be like nice and neat so that's what I'm gonna do but now I think I'm gonna have a lie down on the sofa because I don't start work for another hour and no one else is awake in the house it's just me <laughs> hello I can talk at normal volume now because it's the middle of the day and mum is awake. I have done my first white girl purchase of the year. Now I don't think it's exclusive to white girls, it's, it's basic bitches is what I'm trying to get to. I have a Stanley Cup! I've wanted one for a while. But they all sold out in the lead up to Christmas because everyone was getting them. And I've got one and it's so cute and it's so good um they didn't have any spare straws so i'm gonna keep an eye on the website to get some extra straws but yeah i've got my own stanley cup and i'm really happy hopefully this will encourage me to drink more water because i'm drinking dash waters but they're quite expensive and sorry i've got the hiccups they're quite expensive and well, yeah they're just quite expensive so Hopefully this will encourage me to drink more normal water and I love it. It's it's huge, like it's bigger than my face. And it's quite white as well. I love the handle. I don't know why, but this handle makes it like everything to me. <laughs> Good morning. It is I'm so tired, sorry. Um, it is Thursday. Um, I didn't film yesterday because I was in London town. Um, and I feel broken. I, so I did my personal training session on Tuesday and my legs are in so much pain. And then yesterday walking around London and then at the station, one of the escalators was broken. So we were walking down the emergency exit stairs and it was like hundreds of people just barreling down these stairs and I thought I was going to get trampled. It wasn't the best, I'm not going to lie. Um, so yeah, that's where we're at. Um, I'm in pain today. Um, I'm sat at my work desk because I start work... Oh, sorry, my dad just texted me. Um, I start work... Um, in about 20 minutes, but... I couldn't face sitting over there and then getting up and coming and sitting here because my legs hurt so much. <sighs> um, so yeah, I'm just sat here with my orange juice and my water and my Stanley cup, which I'm very happy about still. Um, it's got ice in, um, so I put ice in it on Tuesday and the ice has finally melted now. Um, so I've put new ice in, which is good. So that should keep me going for another day or two. Sorry, my eyes are so tired and now there's sirens. I live in a village, why is there sirens? <laughs> oh, anyway, um, so yeah, I'm just gonna scroll Instagram for like five minutes and then I'll log in, I think, is what I'm gonna do. Um, oh, I uploaded my first like short slash real slash TikTok. It's not been well received. <laughs> No, I'm lying. Uh, it's got quite a few likes, actually. More than I was expecting. Um, and there's, like, varying amounts of views, which I found... Sorry, the neighbours have just put their lights on their car on. Um, so, yeah, really varying numbers of views, which I found really interesting. So, I've got 82 on Reels. I've got... 215 on shorts and then TikTok I have 743 
which I found really interesting that this is exactly the same reel with the same music the same caption and it's got such varying views which is interesting isn't it so anyway I need to get ready for work I will see you at lunchtime or after work good morning it's friday um i didn't end up filming anything yesterday after yesterday morning so i'm sorry about that but i'm here um the reason i didn't film much yesterday is because i didn't really do much because i'm in so much pain and i know i've already mentioned it so i won't go on about it but the amount of pain i'm in from the gym is insane i'm still in pain today my legs still really hurt and I've got another PT session this afternoon after work. So I'm really scared because I'm still in pain from last session. And now I have to go and do another one. And I was going to reschedule, but I think it's too late now to reschedule. So yeah, I'm really scared. Um, not looking forward to it at all. I want to cancel. <laughs> no, it's fine. Um, I'm very tired today, I don't know why, because I think it's just London catching up with me. It always takes it out of me when I go to London, it's really like exhausting for me. Um, but yeah, it's Friday, got one more day of work and then I get a couple of days off to rest. It's my birthday next week, I turn 30. And I'm terrified to turn 30. Um, I just feel like I thought everything would be quite different by the time I turned 30. And yeah, it's not going to be. So yeah, heavy thoughts for a Friday morning. Um, oh dear. Um, so yeah, this time next week I'll be 30. Um, at the moment we're just planning to go to the cinema um, maybe go bowling and go for lunch because I've got the day of work um, so it's just me and my mum and then I think I might see my dad at the weekend and do something next weekend um, so I don't have huge plans for my 30th but it should be good still she says through gritted teeth because <laughs> she's terrified but yeah anyway um i've got 10 minutes before i'm meant to be working so i'm gonna put you away and i'm gonna go and get up which is gonna take me a while and then move over to the desk so yeah i'll see you later oh you on you <laughs> i've got the dog down here Hello. <laughs> um, it is Saturday morning. We made it to the weekend, guys. Well done, everybody. Um, and yeah, I forgot to vlog last night because we went to the gym and I did my personal training session and I smashed it. I'm not going to lie. Like, I managed to do it and I was in a lot of pain and I told him that so we like adapted the exercises that we did um and then he showed me like the massage guns like that they have in the gym and I'm not gonna lie I was quite snobby about them at first because I've always thought that they're just something that all these gym bros use and that you don't actually need them and they're just like oh yeah like the same guys who would like make like loads of like grunting noises when they do the exercises i had like a really like hello darling i had like a really um low opinion of them um but he showed me them and they actually work low-key surprised um because i i used them on my legs which is what was hurting the most and I was able to walk out the gym better than I walked into the gym and I don't know if that's just because the exercises we were doing was like trying to like stimulate the legs and like move them a bit more but yeah I think the massage guns definitely helped so that's me eating my words um but yeah it's good to be proved wrong sometimes isn't it so yeah 
And then we did go out to eat. We went to Wagamama's. Um, but we looked at the calories and stuff before and we chose like the best, like, the lowest calorie meal that we liked, obviously. Um, so yeah, um, I'm feeling good. I don't know if I'm gonna lose that much weight this week because I haven't eaten the best. So I'm not gonna be surprised if I haven't lost much this week. But I've lost eight pounds so far, so I'm I'm feeling really proud of myself. Um, yeah. So today, oh hello. Today we might go for coffee. That's why the big lights on because I can't bother to open the curtains if we're about to go out and close the curtains. Um, might go and get a coffee, bring it back. I've got filming and editing to do, and my brother's popping round. Um, because he's going away so he needs his passport so he's coming to get his passport which is not where we left it hmm. my mum might have moved it but it was there and it's now not there so I'm like has he already come and got his passport in the middle of the night potentially um <laughs> so yeah um Lily is starting to get a bit um and antsy um because I haven't fed her yet um, and it is seven past eight, so it's a bit later than, hey, get me, it's a bit later than she would normally eat, so I'm going to feed her, so I'm going to go, but I will see you again soon. morning how are you doing uh it's sunday morning i don't know where i got to with filming yesterday because i actually filmed a lot for my other channel i was filming i filmed two videos and i've edited one of them so that's going up on friday and then i've literally just finished filming another video that's going up on tuesday so i'm all over the the youtubes this weekend um but now what's going on today what is going on today? We've got a delivery coming. Um, so the food shop's coming. And then we have to go into town because I've bought mum a Bridgerton puzzle um, as a present because I thought she might get it for me for Christmas because I mentioned that I liked it and she didn't. But I know she'd like it so I'm going to get it for her just because um and now everyone's coming down the stairs so i'm gonna go and i'll see you in a minute <laughs> right i'm back <laughs> um so yeah i just wanted to wrap up this vlog really um because i need to edit and upload you for tonight so thank you so much for watching if you've made it this far that's amazing and i will see you next week and i will be 30 by the time this next week's video goes live that's terrifying <laughs> okay bye guys